Are you wondering what the best subwoofer is for this year? If so, stay tuned, because by the end of the short video, you'll know exactly which one to choose. Hey guys, it's 7 Top Rated, and in today's video, we're going to check out the 5 best subwoofers on the market. This list was made based on our personal views and are listed based on price, quality, durability, and more. To see prices and get more info about the product shown, be sure to check out the description below. One last thing before we dive in, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell to get the latest product reviews from the channel. Okay, so let's get started with today's video. At number 5 is the Polk Audio PSW10. Polk Audio have been in business since 1972 churning out a vast catalog of quality audio equipment ever since. So when it comes to subwoofers, one of their most popular models is the Audio PSW10. The value on offer for this excellent subwoofer is apparent from the moment you plug it in and turn up the bass. Let's take a closer look. Design-wise, the Pogue PSW10 is sleek and blends in nicely with modern home interior decor. The subwoofer comes with a built-in high current amplifier and a 10-inch polymer composite dynamic balance cone driver for deep bass reproduction. On the back of the PSW10, you will find a good variety of connections, including both line level inputs, left and right, and speaker level inputs, which allow easy connection to soundbars or integrate into a 5.1 or 7.1 home theater setup. On to performance, the amplifier produces 50 watts RMS, 100 watts dynamic power. Polk Audio PSW10 10-inch powered subwoofer's overall frequency response is 35 to 200 Hz. Low-path crossover frequency response is about 80 to 160 Hz. It really performs above expectations and delivers a thunderous sound that surpasses what you can expect from a subwoofer of this compact size. The bass response is deep, tight, and punchy and will sound great in a home theater system. Plus, watching movies makes you feel as though you are sitting in a real-life cinema with deep surround sound effects. We like that you can easily integrate your existing system. Simply hook up this sub to your receiver and upgrade your music sound instantly. To conclude, ultimately, it's easy to see why Polk Audio's PSW10 is such a hit. It offers those on a budget a reliable and respectable subwoofer, which can give a good insight into the lower end of your mix. It's not flawless, but at this price, not much can touch it. At number 4 is the Klipsch R100SW 10-inch subwoofer. The R100SW is one of several subwoofers of varying size and power in Klipsch's extensive reference product line and is a solid speaker that remains one of the most popular subwoofers on the market today. The R100SW is housed in a stylish cabinet measuring 14.5 by 12.5 by 16.4 inches that's made of high-quality reinforced MDF. Apart from making the subwoofer long-lasting, the MDF construction gives you a great listening experience that is free from vibrations. On the front, it has exposed fasteners, low-profile magnetic grills, and a scratch-resistant textured wood grain vinyl, which gives the R100SW subwoofer a polished modern appearance. Additionally, the injection-molded graphite or IMG woofer cones are exceptionally light while being extremely rigid and provide a remarkable low-frequency response, with minimal cone breakup and distortion to give you the deepest, cleanest bass possible. Performance-wise, the R100SW uses a 10-inch copper-spun IMG woofer with a front-firing configuration and an all-digital 150-watt RMS amplifier that boasts 300 watts of power. Plus, reference subwoofer gain, low-pass crossover, and phase controls ensure low-frequency tones blend with other speakers and deliver punchy bass down to 32 Hz, the ideal level of bass for your room. The controls are easily accessed for volume, low-pass crossover, and phase correction to get customized bass. Connect via LFE or unfiltered low-pass disabled or stereo line-level RCA inputs 
that offer maximum compatibility with home theater receivers. Overall, the Klipsch R100SW subwoofer produces crisp, clear sounds coupled with deep bass that will make watching movies and listening to music a truly mesmerizing experience and is one we would recommend. At number 3 is the Cambridge Audio Minx X201. Enjoy genuine hi-fi sound quality but demand discreet style? Then take a look at the Cambridge Audio Minx X201. It may be the smallest Minx subwoofer, but don't underestimate the performance. Let's check it out. Design-wise, the understated design ensures that no matter your interior decoration choices, the Minx X201 is always right at home. At just 22 centimeters or 9 inches cubed and finished in high gloss black or white, these tiny subwoofers are beautifully subtle and unobtrusive. The X201 uses a 165 millimeter or 6.5 inch forward firing driver made of a single piece of super strong aerospace grade aluminum for amazing punch and attack. It's paired with dual passive radiators that add some serious mid bass boost. Looking at performance, the 200 watt Minx subwoofer features a sophisticated digital signal processor or DSP to provide real time control of equalization and dynamic range. This results in a tighter bass and less distortion at high volumes. It features a 36 to 200 Hz frequency response, and its gain, phase, and crossover frequency can be controlled via the rear panel knobs. With these true hi-fi capabilities, regardless of your room shape and size, the Minx's simple setup adjustments ensure your system is perfectly customized for placement almost anywhere. The Minx X201's auto-on mode automatically powers on the unit when it detects an incoming signal. This means you don't have to leave it on, which is useful for keeping your electricity bills down. We must mention the power on offer from such small speakers defies physics, while the thrilling dynamics, clear detail, and punchy potent bass create the illusion that there are much larger speakers in the room. To conclude, the Cambridge Audio Minx X201 is a system with great dynamics and depth that defy its small size. Perfect speakers for a discreet and efficient system, and one that won't disappoint. You should definitely consider it. At number 2 is the Sonos Sub. It's a lot to pay for a subwoofer that can be used with non-Sonos hardware. That being said, if you can swing the cost, you'll get a tremendous boost to sound quality that integrates smoothly with a full Sonos network. The Sonos Sub is no small bit of kit, nor is it light at 36 pounds, but it is very well designed. Available in a black gloss finish with a white Sonos logo or a white gloss finish with a black Sonos logo, the Sonos Sub shimmers and shines as light hits it. In addition, the two 4.5 by 7 inch racetrack drivers facing each other across the central cavity, a design that cancels vibration. You can stand it up or lay it flat, and at just 6.2 inches thick, it slips easily into small spaces, certainly under most end tables, maybe even under a couch. On the underside of the sub, you'll find a hidden power port and an ethernet cable, both of which are out of sight. As for performance, the whole point behind a subwoofer is to provide deep and sustained bass. The Sonos Sub doesn't disappoint on either front. Using twin force-canceling drivers with separate Class D amplifiers, the Sonos Sub provides a bass that is not only deep enough to rattle the windows, but also punchy, agile, and dynamic. The bass simply sounds exactly as it should, fast and deep, with zero cabinet buzz or rattle. Furthermore, the Sonos Sub is a breeze to set up. With no wiring or programming required, simply press one button and follow the prompts from the Sonos system controller. It automatically adjusts the audio settings to ensure that the sub is fully optimized to work with your paired Sonos components. Overall, the Sonos sub sounds great, offering plenty of bass. It isn't for everyone, but pair with Sonos Beam, Play Bar, or Play Bass for incredible home theater, and add rear surrounds for immersive sound. It's an excellent addition to the Sonos system, if you can afford it. At number one is the ELAC Debut 2.0 Sub 3010. ELAC's new Sub 3010 is designed as the perfect complement to the all new Debut 2.0 loudspeakers, adding a powerful bass foundation to music and soundtracks that turn your system into a sensation you can feel as well as hear. 
Design-wise, the Sub 3010 has thick MDF cabinet walls with black ash vinyl finish and weighs 32.1 pounds. The horizontal center brace is engineered to strengthen and stiffen the cabinet, helping to minimize unwanted vibrations that can discolor music or movie content. The 10-inch long throw driver is designed to produce the quality and quantity of bass needed to accurately reproduce demanding movie soundtracks and music. The 10-inch passive radiator is engineered to improve transient response and increase the efficiency of the system. In addition, the bash amplifier tracks the input signal and adjusts the available supply voltage to a traditional Class AB amplifier, helping to make the amplifier more efficient and provide the on-demand power needed for dynamic movies and music. On to performance, the front-firing subwoofer features a 10-inch high-excursion doped paper cone woofer with a 10-inch high-excursion doped paper cone passive bass radiator and delivers up to 400 watts of peak power with a frequency response of 28 to 150 hertz. The Sub 3010 incorporates a digital control system, doing away with traditional analog controls. Simply download the Elax Sub EQ app for your Bluetooth 4.0 equipped Android or iOS smartphone for complete control. The subwoofer will automatically adjust its EQ to your room's characteristics using eight parametric curves. We must mention the Sub 3010 will detect when an audio signal is being sent to the amplifier and power on. Also, to conserve energy, the subwoofer will power off after a long period of inactivity. To conclude, the Elac Sub 3010 has been engineered and built to deliver huge performance at an affordable price. The compact design allows placement in almost any part of your room, and sophisticated app-controlled EQ assures seamless integration into your system. And that's why it tops our list. Thanks for watching the video. We hope you found it useful. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this in the future. If you do have any questions related to these products, you can leave a comment below and we'll get back to you. Catch you soon.